the first symptom, perhaps the greatest symptom, is simply not to care about having a relationship with Allah Azza wa Jal anymore. Simply, you don't care to have this attitude about the religion, about a relationship with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is really of the greatest symptoms that a person has a hard heart. Another symptom of having a hard heart to not enjoy the actions of worship. That even when a person prays, or when a person reads Quran, or when a person is in a religious gathering, he finds himself in a different realm. He zones out. The prayer itself becomes routine. It becomes monotonous. There's no enjoyment. There's no pleasure. Even though the greatest pleasure, the greatest pleasure that every person should have is the pleasure of having a relationship with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. If you're not going to find happiness in the actions of worship, this is a symptom that the heart is hard. Another symptom that this disease exists in the minds or in the hearts of a certain person is that this person simply does not benefit from advice. He doesn't benefit from listening to lectures, from being in an Islamic environment. Many a times people who have a hard heart, they actually become arrogant towards religious gatherings. They look down as if these are the masses. They need to go and get some religious iman boost by going to a lecture. By, ah, I don't need this, who cares? This is for the sheep, I don't need it. You find a sense of nonchalance, a sense of arrogance that this person is superior to the rest of humanity. As if every person does not need some spirituality. But no, the one whose heart is hard, he doesn't care anymore about listening to advice. And this is again one of the biggest problems of the hardness of the heart, that a person simply does not care about listening to advice anymore. And the final symptom that we'll mention is that the one whose heart is hard, not only does he habitually commit sins, sins become a lifestyle for him, even worse, there is no conscience, no guilt. He doesn't feel anything. So what? So the sins are there. Even worse than the sin itself is that com you commit a sin and you really just don't care that you just did a sin. Because the sinner who is repentant, there's hope for him. But the sinner who doesn't even realize, who doesn't even care he's committing a sin, there is no doubt that this is of the worst symptoms of the hardness of the heart. There are many diseases of the heart. Arrogance is one of them. Being jealous is one of them. But you see, when you have the hardness of the heart, all of the other diseases, it's as if your heart is saying, come, enter. There's no way to prevent you. There's no blockage. It is literally the aids of the spiritual body. And that is to have a hard heart.